Howdy and welcome to another episode of the Laptop Empire Show. I'm your host, Mike Yonda, co-founder of LaptopEmpires.com, and it's time for another edition of 5-Minute Facebook Ads. So what's going to happen is we're going to hop over to the computer, and in the next five minutes, I'm going to show you how to create a very simple list building campaign. And I'm talking about growing your email list on the cheap using Facebook ads. You're going to learn how to do it in just five minutes. Let's check it out. All right, it's time to grow your email list on the cheap using Facebook ads. I love Facebook ads for list building. I've been doing it for years. And what's really great about it is that you can so affordably get the perfect email subscriber to download what you want, start growing your email list from day one. And the range of costs that you can pay, I mean, it is it is super affordable. I've spent as little as six cents to get an email subscriber. I will admit that was a couple of years ago, so it's a little bit more expensive uh, now, but depending on your industry, you can still spend less than a dollar to get an email subscriber. You'll see one of these new campaigns we're testing. We've had over 500 uh, email subscribers in the last month, paying only a dollar per subscriber. Um, and that's on the high end. I've got a lot of campaigns right now where we're paying 30, 50, 70 cents an email subscriber. So if you want to start growing your email list, this is a great way to do it. Now, the first thing you do, you go to the green button, you start your campaign. You actually have two options if you want to grow your email list. You can run a conversion campaign, and conversion just means that they convert on an objective. It means that they hit a landing page, kind of like this one. They click a button, and they enter in their information. They're going to enter in their name, their email, and join your email list. The other option is lead gen. This is the Facebook native one. It does not require software. That's what I'm going to show you today because it's the easiest one to get started. But if you want to run a conversion campaign, which sometimes can actually be cheaper and be more effective, and you want to be able to create landing pages like this, um, you're going to need software. We highly recommend ClickFunnels. If you go into the description and use our ClickFunnels link to join ClickFunnels and get your software to start building your funnel, we will actually give you a template funnel that converts 35 to 85%. That's the ranges we've done um, for growing your list. It's completely done. You just copy and paste the link. The funnel will be right there with everything you need. You just add your own image and you change the words to fit whatever it is you're doing. And then you'll easily be able to start growing your email list. But if you don't want to use the software, that's perfectly okay. You can use the lead gen objective. You're going to select it and the lead gen objective is going to collect all of the information right here on Facebook. The people don't have to leave Facebook at all. What you're going to do is you're going to you're going to choose your settings first. Like what are you trying to grow, you know, your list for? Um, I talk about this in the last five minute Facebook ads for growing your traffic. Um, and so I'm, I want you to go back and watch that video to figure out how to select your targeting because I need to spend a little bit more time. We've only got five minutes. I've got some other things I need to do, but you can pretty much choose anything here. If you've got a fitness guide, you just type in fitness and wellness, right? And you're going to be able to type target a whole bunch of people. If you want weight loss specifically, you can type in weight loss. Boom. Extreme people interested in extreme weight loss. Perfect. Those are the people we want to target for our fitness guide. Okay. You're going to go down. You're going to do placements. Once again, like last time, I prefer mobile. Mobile is going to get you the best conversions. That's where most people are. So newsfeed only mobile is the best option you can do. Unlike traffic campaigns, the minimum you can do is $5 a day, but you can do really well with $5 a day. So choose that $5 daily budget. Of course, you can go and do more things if you need to. One thing I got to do here is I've got to accept the terms and conditions for lead ads. Um, I, I don't know why it's making me do that again, but it's a requirement. Now, for a lead form, you are going to create your ads. You're going to want to have your image. You're going to want to have your text. You're going to want to have your link, right? So I might have this guide link and we're going to go ahead and put that up oh, as a lead form. Sorry, we don't have a link. So this is just going to be a display link. I'm just going to put laptopempires.com. Since we're a lead form, we're not going off oh, laptopempires.com. All right. And we'll go ahead. We'll just use that image and it'll say something like get our incredibly awesome free guide that teaches you how to do all the things and stuff on Facebook in five minutes. Awesome. And then headline, you know, we might do something like free guide. Use Facebook ads in five minutes flat. Boom. Okay. 
And then we'll go ahead and we'll say download because they're downloading a free guide. Okay, so that's, you set up the ad. Now you need to create a form and the form is what you're gonna do to collect the information. Okay, so there's a couple settings you need to know about. First off, go to settings on this side and you'll see it says restricted or open. We wanna do open because what open does is it allows when somebody shares your ad and people that they're friends with see it, those people can opt in and you can get that information. If it's restricted, they can't share it, the people can't opt in. So this gets you free email subscribers. We 100% want that. The next thing you wanna do is figure out, do you want more volume or higher intent? In theory, higher intent sounds nice, like they're more likely to, to convert, but we've found that just doing more volume is more effective. So leave it at more volume, okay? This intro card, you can put all kinds of information. We don't even do it. We just turn it off. It's We've tested it, it's more effective that way, but you can always try writing in a headline, information, adding an image, whatever you wanna do. We turn it off, we just go straight to the questions, Name and email, right? Boom, that's all we want. And watch this, I want name to be first. So if I check email second, then it'll become the second option here. All right, then what you're gonna do is you're gonna put the privacy policy from your website, whatever that is, right? Google.com, you know, slash privacy. You have to have that. Then you're gonna have a thank you screen. This is super important. This is a, something you can take advantage of. You can say here, you know, thanks for signing up for our Facebook ads guide. Please click the button below to download a free bonus training, right? Teaching you X, Y, Z. Or you can say, click the button to go get whatever it is you want, right? Uh, click here for bonus, right? Maybe we say free bonus, okay? And then you're gonna put the website URL, whatever it may be, all right? Now we wanna do this, I, this is really important. You don't wanna just send them to your website. You wanna send them somewhere else. You can actually send them directly to the content. You could send them to a bonus content. You could send them to something called a tripwire where it's like, hey, for right now, if you, uh, you just downloaded this guide, but for the next 15 minutes, you can buy this special, you know, offer. It's only $7. You get this exclusive training and, um, you know, that teaches you in depth how to do boom, boom, boom. And it takes them to the next level. And that can be a great way to earn back some of your ad costs. So send them to wherever it is that you want to send them. But I always like to send them to, you know, a free bonus piece of content or something extra. Maybe they signed up for a PDF guide and you send them to a webinar and the webinar sells them on something else, whatever it may be, but you always want to send them to something extra. And that's a really easy way. And all you're going to do is you're going to click finish. Now, when you do, all right, whenever somebody clicks on the ad, it's going to pop up in the ad is going to, when they click on the ad, this is what's going to pop up. It's going to automatically put their name and their email address. And then once they hit submit, they're going to see this and have the option to go somewhere else. Now, all you need to do is connect this to your email marketing software. So if you use active campaign like I do, or maybe your blogger use ConvertKit, use Aweber, whatever it may be, you can very easily connect it to these lead ads using a software called Zapier, zapier.com. All right, free software. Um, there are some paid features, but you're gonna be able to connect it so that every time somebody submits one of these forms, it's gonna be sent to your email automatically and you can send them an automated email uh, you know, an automated email sequence, selling whatever, or just warming them up, you know, before you get into your main content. So that's it for today's uh, edition of 5-Minute Facebook Ads. Go start growing your email list. All right, that's it for this edition of 5-Minute Facebook Ads. Thank you so much for watching the Laptop Empire show. Please do me a favor, go ahead and subscribe to the channel because I want to make sure you never miss out on an episode. We've got new episodes every Tuesday, 5 p.m. Central Standard Time. And once you're done with that, Make sure you go into the description, you check out the comments, and get access to our free Facebook Ads Masterclass. You sign up for it, it's free, you go through, and we walk you through an hour, show you how to use Ads Manager, show you over the shoulder how you can get started, how to start leveraging Facebook Ads in your business to grow your brand, grow your website, and grow your email list. Make sure you check it out.